Hey, it's Jason with Dad's That Cook, and we're hanging out with Big Al Ramorin. Big Al has a food truck that is crazy good called Aloha Prime Eatery down from South Maui Gardens. I've eaten there a hundred thousand times already. Yeah. What are we gonna make today? We're making our uh, potato crusted mahi. It's actually one of our signature dishes down at the food truck. So what are we making? So I see a sauce you're getting ready to whip up. We're making the red wine beru sauce. What's so it called? Red wine butter sauce, basically. That's what, that's what it means. Some red wine right here. Red wine? About, about a cup of sugar right about a cup of sugar. Yeah. And then, of course, put some fresh lemons in there. Nice lemon. Ooh, you throw the whole thing in, you throw right? the whole thing in. Just yeah, go yeah. nuts. And then, of course, a little, a little, bit of sea a little salt. salt. Let it reduce. When it starts to bubble up a little bit, and when it gets about almost a quarter way down, then we're going to start adding in some butter. Right? So are you professionally trained? So I worked in almost 30 different restaurants. So wow. everywhere I went, I'd try to, you know. Grab a little something yeah, here yeah, and there. Some knowledge here and there. And so it's our Yukon potatoes for our mashed potatoes. So my mashed potatoes are very simple. Heavy whipping cream and butter and salt. You've got kids, right? So you got these two little kids. Six year old and a four year old. Six and yeah, four, yeah. And busy, and they like your food. They love food. They love. They actually love to cook. Do they? They they, they hop in. They help out. Oh, I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you drained out your potatoes. Yep. So we got our Yukon gold potatoes. You break it up a little bit. So right there, you add in our cream and butter. More oh. butter, more better. More better, buddy. I'm just gonna whisk them around. Take time, nice and soft. Yeah, yeah. Just go around the bowl. The salt, the salt, butter. Cream. Butter. Cream. That's it. And potatoes. Delicious. <laughs> right? I can eat a whole bucket yeah, of that, right? man. So our brew sauce is getting close. You can see right here where it starts to bubble up like that a little uh -huh. bit. It reduced down enough for me to start folding in the butter. Oh, yeah. That big old chef knife <laughs> with the butter, huh? Oh, hey, my bro. God. Now just lick yeah. it with your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, more bottom, more better. More butter. Right? Whisk and slow on low. Whisk and slow on low. Sweet. You want to do a spoon test. If it, it coats the spoon like that, uh -huh. it's ready to go. So we're making a white wine butter sauce now. So you yeah. got some white wine in there? A little white wine in there. And some sugar. A um, little, little sugar. Sweet and salty. Fresh lemon juice in there. This time we're going to add some cream. A little cream. We got the fish We're going to crust up the fish, the mahi-mahi. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Yeah. The way I bread it is we have to dunk it in the flour mm -hmm. and then we go in the egg. And I do a double flour. If you don't double dunk the flour, yeah. you won't grab the chips. Huh. The chips are already seasoned. And um, and what kind, what kind of chips you got there? I use uh, Maui chips. The Maui chips? Yeah, Maui style chips. And you can see now it's crusted. See that? And it is crusted. Yeah. And you're only doing one side. We're only doing one side. Okay, so you don't yeah. need to dredge the whole entire no, no, fish. No. And that reduced pretty simple on its own. Yeah, so you remember yeah. what we had earlier and what it looked like, but now let's well, reduce it. That's just the cream and the wine yeah. and a little bit of salt and sugar, right? Yes, sir, and, then, and some lemon juice. So right there, it's reduced enough, and then now we're going to fold in the butter. Same the thing butter. like same thing like the barouge. You're kind of saucy, aren't you? Yeah, bro. Just yeah. so that outside. Okay, so now we're going to bread the artichokes for the... But you're going to put any, any canned artichokes would do. I prefer quarter cut artichokes. And you just do is just toss them in flour. So we got some oil. We're going to heat up the oil. And we're just going to fry these artichokes. Nice. You don't have to add anything to it. Just flour and artichoke. Okay, so those are the fried artichokes. Sweet. Good to go. Before, before you cook out the fish, you want to make sure the pan is hot. And we're just going to go ahead and put it on. We only got room for two, so we're just going to okay. put two we'll in here. We'll two. save the other one later. Potato chip side, Dad. Yep, yep. Flip. Wow, look at that. Oh, yeah. Look that's that. nice, so nice crust crunchy. right there. Yeah. Yes. Once you flip it over, we're going to fill it with a little lemon juice. Yeah. Into the oven we go. Wow. Seven minutes, yeah. 450. So while while that's going on, a little oil, a little butter. I love butter. You like butter? <laughs> butter. My bottom will bend on my bottom. So we're going to try the experience while the butter is all dancing. A little sprinkle of salt. I'm just gonna let it saute up a little bit, deglaze it with a little white wine. That's gonna be a party right I there. I can tell, they're perfect. So now we're down to the important part, which is plating your dish, right? Because you want it to look attractive, so people are just gonna dive into it and swallow it quickly. And with potatoes. Put just a dollop on there in the middle. You got the red wine barouge sauce. Barouge. Right? I gotta remember that name. For Blanc. The Blanc. The Bur Blanc. And then, of course, we got asparagus. And then, we got our crispy fried artichokes. And we set it right on top. Ooh, look at that. Just a little truffle oil on top. Micro arugula on top for a little garnish. Hanging out with Big Al. Now it's taste test time. Let's dig in, the bro. Potato crusted mahi mahi. 
get a bite right into that. Hmm. Wow. Oh my god, that's so good. Let me try one of these little artichokes hiding out over here. Mm. I like the sweetness of the sauce. Mm -hmm. You know, you wouldn't think, you know, a sweet with this would be like with fish. Sweet and savory, bro. The taters are like. Do a nice crust. Mo butter, you know. Yeah. <laughs> These are mo butter potatoes. Oh, my God. Okay, so now we got the true taster, right? Hi. Shelby, <laughs> the, the other better half. And so he made this for you. Yes, when we first started dating. And it blew me away. And she's had this, I don't know how many times, but. A lot. What do you think? Nailed it. Yeah. Nailed it. <laughs> Nailed it. What's interesting is all the textured layers you've got going on, right? Mm -hmm. You've got the crunch from the fish. You've got the puree of the potatoes, which is like that smoothiness. And it's absolutely delicious. It's incredible. All right, so that's it. We're, we're hanging out with our Ramoran family. We've got to eat some incredible food. You're going to love it. You need to come down to Aloha Prime Eatery, the South Maui Gardens, because that's sure. where we're going to find these two lovely people. Thank I appreciate it. Pleasure. Thank you. Thanks for having me, having us. <laughs> I wanted you too. Right? So come on down to Aloha Prime Eatery. You can check out the dish, or you can go on the website right here and you can get the recipe too. You can make it yourself. Aloha, guys.